There's your fog light and your front grill. I need the grill. The fog light, I don't really care that much about. Well, I think it's done anyway. <laughs> Found a wild James. Random James. Random James. Uh, I think we're gonna go skid and film it. Film some skids. We actually have daylight. Look at the sky, it's daylight. So uh, I brought I brought the GoPro and I think I'm gonna set up the GoPro like on my mirror or something, facing the back so that you could see how the rear does. And then this one we can either face outside the car somewhere else or hold it like and we can take turns going around like teardrop and Belmer and get outside shots because then we have your camera too yes. so we have lots of views so if you haven't uh, check out James's channel because he may have some different footage than I have and you'll get extra footage from the both of us so check out his channel uh, James Heishman link in the description also at the end of the video there will be a link so check that out It's not a drift car if you don't have stickers. Nope, and they've got to be glittery, so. Oh, man. I don't have any stickers. You'll get there, man. I have one. I have the, the spooled up sticker. I've got like five stickers in the glove box. Oh, there's the Insta. Boom. Same thing for the YouTube. Yep. to the end of the video for some good donuts and some good burnout stuff because it's going to be a good time not had by the cowmobile because it's broken i don't know what's going on something's jacked bro whether it's like an axle or your diff yeah something's messed up and like when you see the car moving you really see the angle yeah, on I it i can feel it bro <laughs> Dude, hold on. Your front wheel is further back. Oh, I know. I hit something hard. Jesse, it's like our third time out, buddy. Oh, mm. it's touching. Oh, it fucked the fender up. <laughs> I got a little excited. That angle kit. There's your fog light. And your front grill. I need the grill. The fog light, I don't really care that much about. Well, I think it's done anyway. <laughs> But I need this. Oh my gosh. Well, right, we're close well, to the shop, so. I don't think we can make it to the shop, though, I'm gonna be honest. You don't think so? No. I mean, we can get. Oh, you don't have your Tahoe. Well, we can have to go get it. Oh, I fucked something up. Yeah. Because, <laughs> like, as you went to drive away, it was just. Man, but the low light. Does it do well? Yeah, it would. Let's call Carl. Jesse, I was just trying to slide. <laughs> I fucked up, dude. <laughs>
<laughs> it's gone. Ah, yeah, we'll just trim it down and paint them. They'll look fine. Didn't pop the tire, luckily. Dude, it's on there. filmed this once but it was kind of weird we're gonna do it again so if you look at this it's got like some positive camber back here um, it's not supposed to be like that let's show you how it's supposed to be it's supposed to be like this eventually I was gonna get it a camber kit so that I can make it um, to where it was like level there's no camber at all now might be the time to get that. <laughs> um, and the front is like, <laughs> I don't have words for this, but the front is pretty uh, toasted. Um, <clears throat> it, look, it seriously looks like it's pushed back. Put your foot in there. Six or seven inches. Okay, and then look at the rears. Let's show you how it's supposed to be. Okay. So we're gonna jack it up and we're gonna find out what's going on over here. It smells so bad, something is like is burning. That, that smell again? That is that, that's exactly what that is, you're right. So when I got the it car, smelled like this before. it was like a dead smell. There was like something going on where it smelled fucking dead. And that's what this is, it's, it's, it's that dead smell. It's bad. If anybody knows if there's like a fluid in a car that if it touches like heat smells like a dead animal, let me know because that's what it is. Or the, or the other option is there's a dead animal and I just knocked it loose. True, I could have moved. So we, uh, we're going to pull the Beamer apart, but for now we're going to go drift some more. Yeah. I know that might one, be the, one might of not be the smartest thing to do, but we're going to go drift some more. Um, we're gonna go back here. James wants to do some. You know how to turn that one on, right? So you can turn it on without, with just with your hand. Yeah. Don't do it yet. Yeah. But, but yeah, I can reach it. Okay. We're gonna go do some drift, drifty drifts. Redemption, go. YouTube, you are lucky that there's not a smell cam because this smells so fucking bad. What's it from? Is, I mean, is this your power steering that's making this wet? Yeah. I don't know if power steering like smells like a dead animal though. Um, over here, you can see that the control arm is straight. The part where the strut bolts to is straight. 
and all that. Over here, it's totally bent. It's bent. Here, I'll go over there and point to it. Yeah, part of the strut bolts too is bent. Is it? Looks like it. Yeah. This? Yeah. Yeah, that's bent. So this is carbon anyway. I don't know what those are for. Some BMW like stop the rattle crap. So that right there is bent. Um, yeah, a little bit. That knuckle over there looks like it's bent. For sure. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's tweaked for sure. Surprised you drive around like this. I'm I am too. I'm surprised it wasn't rubbing more. I'm surprised it didn't like. It's a good fold up under the car. That's what I was worried about the yeah. whole time. How did it take the right into here? Like onto the street the shop's on. I don't know. I'm scared to pull it off. Okay, here we go. Ta-da! Oh, do you want me to grab that flashlight? So it ripped oh. this out the rest of the way. The sway bar? Number one. The tie rods look fine. Um, coil over looks okay. So let's show back. Is it just the control arm? Because if so, then I'd say I got away with a pretty decent... Uh, first accident. Um, I'm pretty sure the lower control arm is not supposed to go like that. I think it's supposed to be flat and it's almost like in a U shape. If you see what I'm talking about. Yes. How it's, it's curved, curved down. down. Yeah. Yeah, that's not how that's supposed to be. Which explains why your sway bar was ripped off. It broke the sway bar in half, it looks like. Oh, it goes down. Oh, okay, I see it. Oh, lower control arm for front and rear. And I'm buying control arms anyway. So, it's solid. Win win. <laughs> <laughs> it was a. Uh, in the smell? Oh my gosh. Can you describe the smell for me? I can try my best. Um, have you ever like smelled a dead raccoon, a wet dead raccoon? That, that's it. Like a really Weird. old dead wet raccoon. Weird. James. Yeah. Um, I got a question for you. <laughs> it smells really bad in here. Yeah. <laughs> um, would you rather fight a 25 foot lobster or 25 one foot bears? 25 foot lobster. Why? I think I can get around it.
Would you rather box Obama or wrestle Trump in baby oil? I'd rather box Obama. How tall is he? I don't know. Probably pretty tall. He's probably my height. I don't know. Can I box Trump? No. Got them little hands. He's got baby okay. hands. I have a Dotson video getting ready to come out too. But since the vi Dotson video is gonna come out next, but instead the Beamer video is gonna come out because I'm excited to edit it. Uh, but the Dotson video, I'm getting ready to actually pull the wheels off soon, um, start pulling the hub apart so that I can put the adapters on and the axles in. That way we can drive the Dotson before winter time. Um, I wanna get some good driving videos and I actually kinda wanna do my own I know uh, David did an amazing review of the car and Taylor drove it and it was awesome. But I kind of want to do my own story about the car where I sit down and kind of talk about it and how, why the car means so much to me and everything. Um, and put that out for you guys and have a lot of driving footage in it. So that that should come out soon. I hope I, hope I can do it before winter actually hits. Um, if I can, that'll be out. So look out for that. The Dotson footage should be pretty cool. But we're going to get these axles, these newer awesome axles and these adapters in there so that we can actually drive it and not have these poop axles in it. If you liked the video, drop a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, drop a thumbs up. Uh, if you want to stay tuned for future content, uh, so just subscribe, hit the bell below. I think you have to ding the bell or something. And... Um, Stay tuned because we will be doing some fun stuff. Uh, make good choices. Buy more car parts that don't buy drugs. Uh, wear a rubber and kiss your mom before you leave because you never know when you're going to die. Bye.